Yeah. Hi, I'm Koki and I'm the founder of Beekeeper Parade. I was uh, born in 1976 during the Cambodian Civil War at the very beginning. Um, when the war broke out, my mum was put into a prison for pregnant women, which is where I was born. And so I spent the first three years of my life uh, in prison with my mum. Um, we were both uh, tortured and beaten and starved and humiliated while we were there. Um, we were one of the few survivors and um, we, when the war ended uh, three years later, uh, we walked for three days and three nights to the borders of Cambodian Thailand. We got smuggled across, found a refugee campsite, a particular doctor really uh, felt sorry for our family and we were one of the few families that remained intact and he got on the phone and uh, thought he'd help our family get out and within two months we went to to Australia where we grew up in Melbourne. When I became an adult I wanted to say thank you to the people that fought for my freedom when I was younger through education. It's how I felt I was able to lift myself out of poverty. So I went back to Cambodia and I built a school in the very village I was born in. We uh, reached a point where we fundraised over half a million dollars over about a 10 year period and had built five schools. We wanted to help make them the best schools possible and we couldn't do that without continually asking for donations. So um, basically uh, myself and my younger sister looked out to the world and we saw all these profitable businesses making lots of money and thinking why can't we be one of the, these businesses. So Beekeeper is a business that's been created to inspire change in the world. We sell bags and bag-like things and for every bag we sell we send one child in Cambodia to English class for an entire year. Sustainability is important to me because I came into this beekeeper uh, from the point of view of giving back to the world, of helping, um, particularly kids in Cambodia. What I didn't understand is what I would take from the world and so I came to a realization that just because I was trying to do good um, that it didn't mean that it gave me the right to cause harm to the planet or the people. We only have one planet so we can't really keep on taking away from it. Um, and if we can live our life by not harming it, then why, why shouldn't we? The materials we use is stuff that other people have either donated, discarded or thrown away. So it's our way of uh, reducing fashion and textile waste. So far, I can say we've actually upcycled three tons of clothing and fashion waste into our products. Greater than flying and greater than time travel and any comic book superhero's powers is the ability and the power to change the world. And it sits in every single uh, person's hearts. And um, we all get the choice to either use it or leave it dormant. You have it in your hearts and you should use it.